Hey guys, it's uh, Junti. I'm back with another video for Forspoken. So now we got a new gown, and uh, let's just explore the world a little bit more. We got a new mission where we have to find some journals in the past and try to get some perspective for this lady's father yeah, so that like we can find out. But your shoes betray you. These have gotten me out of a lot of scrapes. Where I go, they go. The kick stay. So it shall be. Here, you also need this. It's a map of Athia. should aid you on your journey. Here, I've marked the Cognizance Guild. Perfect. All right, that's the map. It definitely is going to be useful because we need a map for a big game like that, right? So father's findings, that is the mission. Let's try to find those. Thank you again. Tanta's blessings. You too, whatever that means. It's like every every other time you get a, get into a cutscene, man. This game has, has a lot of cutscenes. That that's actually a good thing and a bad thing at the same time because at times you like the story to continue, but at times you want to play the game and there's just too many cutscenes in the way, right? <clears throat> but still, uh, since uh, I am playing the game and I kind of like spend the money on it as well, I'm gonna say that it's good. <laughs> Maybe you should grab an apple. I was thinking the same thing, an man. An apple a day. We'll keep Frey's hunger at bay. Such a poet. The way they pictured the whole scene, you want to take the apple, right? There's so many notifications going on. That's kind of like disturbing. There have to be a way to disable so, this. So, how do we get to this Cognizance's guild place? If I'm reading the peasant girl's map correctly, we'll need to leave the city by the south gate. All right, let's get going then. Yeah, I'm not gonna talk to the NPCs because um, in we came this way last night, right? Yeah. In such games, what happens is that you keep on talking to people, and you keep on getting some extra quests. Can we just get on and find this guild? Greetings. Yeah, let's just avoid the extra people at the moment. We will talk to them later once we have finished uh, maybe the story or a substantial part of the story as well. I'm only going to talk to people once I'm getting bored of playing the regular storyline, so... Yeah. That's going to be the main plan at the moment. Buildings around here look a little shabby. Definitely do. And door is locked. Ugh, damn it! I mean... Well... That was a short Yeah, trip. this door reminds me of the Kaya Perico, you know. How the hell do you get out of this dump anyway? I know a way. She definitely does. You. You've been following me, kid? No. But I know how to help you. Really? He definitely has been following us. I know us. everything around here. Mm-hmm. And what's that gonna cost me? An apple? <laughs> maybe? So you have been following me. Sure. Nice catch. You seem hungry. That's a big apple though. Just follow me. I didn't think she ate it. Don't you want to know my name? Not really. It's Olivia. And you're Frey. Everyone's been talking about you. I guess I'm kind of famous around here. Does famous mean hunted by the gods? Yeah, it definitely means that. <laughs> I call it Finders Keepers. Okay. Damn. Did you steal all this stuff? Not all of it. You're growing on me, kid. Sometimes people have no idea what they're throwing away. I often make new things out of this stuff. Yeah, that's the reason why I never yeah. throw away stuff, you, you know. Hurt, this will I help sell you. it. <laughs> I 
All right, nice. You'll have to give me the recipe. Of course. Let me teach you how. Try All it. All that for an apple? <clears throat> I guess we are gonna learn some recipes now. It's um, it just it's kind of like a tutorial, but they're making that into the story. So they're teaching us crafting. You don't really have to teach us. I mean, people are used to doing this kind of thing, right? They can just figure that out by themselves. But anyway, all right, let's uh, keep on crafting this thing. All right, that's good enough, I guess. What else? People really do throw a lot of stuff away, huh? Huh? Yes, a lot of useless rubbish. I forgot cup for there as well. <laughs> Wait, this might come in yeah, handy. Yeah, definitely. Pick everything up. I'm just waiting to find a vendor where I can sell things as well. That's gonna be interesting. The game definitely has kind of like a Skyrim feel to it as well. It's it's kind of like a modern Skyrim with a mix of future and the past. There's an upgrade option as well. I haven't really checked that out for now. I'm just going with the storyline. Hey Shorty, I got you something. That thing you said is it worth crap? No, not my <laughs> cell phone, and thanks for not swiping that again. I don't steal from friends. Friends? Cool. <laughs> uh, well, as your friend, I got you this. Wow! What is it's that? A torch. Are you a taunter? <laughs> it's a pen light, and no, I'm not a taunter. I... What's the deal with those guys anyway? They were the strongest and most powerful woman in Athia. Okay. They all had gifts. But in the past, they used them to help protect the land. But one day, they will again. They'll come and save us. <sighs> Listen, kid. From personal experience, you gotta look after yourself. Yeah, I can vouch for that. You only really get saved in fairy tales. We're wrong. We'll see. Yeah, the kid has faith. All right. Well, uh, I got a split. Um, you said you knew the best way out of this place. Well, if you climb over that wall there, that should help you get to where you want to be. Cool. <clears throat> Thanks. I'll uh, see you when I see you. I'll keep the city safe while you're gone. Okay. Sure. You do that. And there's a hug. I think the girl is lonely. She she doesn't really have any anybody with her. Like no parents or something like that. I think that's the story of her. But I don't know. Because I haven't seen her around uh, any adults at the moment. So far. <laughs> There we go, we got the jump down and now we are officially outside the space of the city. Well, that's, that's such a long way to go. On the map at least. It looks like that. Let's see if it's really Why long or not. Because I've been there, alright? Let's just leave it at that. What the hell are these things? Are they people? I believe this is what happens when humans are affected Zombies. by the Then I can't kill them. What choice do you have? It's either them or you. So this is what Auden meant when she said people who come out here don't make it very far. Explain why the people of Sapor prefer spending inside of those rooms.
I like the fighting style. It's really easy. You don't really have to do much. Just keep on spamming the buttons and stuff. And you're good to go. You know, there, there should be like a auto... Auto, auto like shoot button. Instead of having to just keep on clicking on the RT R2 button, so you just have to spam that button a lot. That's that's one of the things. How about you do the legwork for a change? Not something that braces a thing for, I think. Yeah, he's not gonna do anything. Oof. Gross. <clears throat> I'm just glad that uh, we actually have this magical power using the vampires. That actually makes playing the game really easy. And so far, I'm, I'm liking it. We got this. There you go. You were watching that, right? Oh, absolutely. Like a hawk. Alright, let's try to find some more interesting things if we can. This is a cave there as well. Let's uh, check that out as well. What do we do if someone's in here? I guess um, we have to fight them. Say hello. Comment on the weather. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they won't be the chatty type. Yeah, suppose we have to fight the beast, whoever is in there, if it is. Anyway, can we not destroy the boxes? They have to be able to destroy the boxes as well. Whoa, do you feel that? Those are powerful magical energies indeed. Why not dive in and see what happens? Really? All right, let's find out what's... This is the kind of thing that happened in Neo as well. You got like the health perk or something like that. But I'm not exactly sure what this does. It's like she can breathe in the water as well. That's nice. Oh, this is a skill up thing. That's okay. Nice one. What the hell was that? Did something happen? I don't know. I feel more powerful, I think. Hmm. Well... Power is always a good thing. Yeah. Alright, we could jump like that now. That's good. I suppose that was needed at that time. Huh. Let's go check that out. Always worth a look, just in case. Oh, no door on this side. Maybe it's on the other side. <laughs> Let's go ahead and check that out. So this is a fast travel Should safe probably house. probably chill here for a while. Wonderful. I for one can't wait to take a load off. Take a <laughs> load off what? Alright, let's keep on leveling up. See how far we can take it. There's some extra things there as well, some letters. I'm not gonna read the letters. It's up to you if you wanna read them. You can just pause the video and read them, but otherwise, you know, it's fine. No problem. The audio story is fine for us as much as they can tell us. Break time's over. Let's get moving. Is 
says the guy who can't even open the door to leave. What's this purple diamond like I have thing? You. They never explained that one. Hmm. Nice, I can fire from the air as well. That's actually a good thing. Alright, so we have some enemies here. here, the compound. Or the camp ground. Yeah. I know what you need. Whoa! Eat it. Nice. I felt like getting the hang of it. I'd say now's the time to strike. Strike what? Oh, shit. Basically, just a couple of moves that she has. Got you on your toes now. Oh. Right. Right. So we got a magic plus one as well. That that's always good, right? To level up. Looks like the coast is clear. I suppose there's a it's lot okay, of chaos. collection material that you can actually get, and you don't even have to get everything. Might as I well guess. pocket this. Because the options are. Versatile, uh, a lot of options there. Another abandoned building, let's uh, try to find out what's inside. Get some more bushes. This is for the health, I guess. Alright, take I wonder how long this thing's been here. Certainly longer than you've been alive. Yeah, that's true. These big zombies, they're everywhere. I'm sure there were nice people before, but come on. Yeah, now we can't really do anything about it. Take that. Almost wishes they'd make it a little more interesting. Nah, all good with nice, easy wins. Thanks. All right, so mana is something that we can collect as well. I'm not exactly sure what it does, but. Something that you have to collect, right? So I'll just keep on doing that. <laughs> you let me know in the comment section what it's all about. And thank you for watching the video so far as well. I'm gonna keep on making some more videos as long as I keep on getting likes and views on the videos. That's the whole program. And hopefully you like the game as well because I'm kind of like enjoying it so far. It's not boring. So let's just see. That was a big jump, and this is a nice thing about her, like, uh, Faye can jump long distances without dying, so, as opposed to Witcher series, like, you jump and you die. <laughs> they fixed that in the latest upgrade, but still, you know. This time, let's try to stay clear of cute animals. Noted. And this time, let's try to be less petulant and annoying, right? <laughs> I'm hardly petulant and annoying. Agree to disagree. I've got some more extra mana. And this is it for this video. Yeah, I'll come back in the next one. How very peculiar.